Hello everyone, so this hopefully will be a very quick video on how to essentially take any video file, such as this one, uh, my watercolor MP4 file, and then split it into frame by frame. Now, this I believe the uh, program runs on Windows and Mac operating systems. I will fully admit I haven't used Windows for years and I will never ever have a Mac or an iPad. I can't say iPhone because I've got one through the company. But needs to say, I'm not a fan of the iProducts. That's my opinion, I'm sticking with it. Anyway, further ado, let's get rocking and rolling. So the, the program here for, for Linux is called FFmpeg. So all we do is, you, there's a, multiple tutorials on how to get this thing downloaded, but get it downloaded and it's it's great. So all you do is you type ffmpeg-i, the name of your water file, and this will be in the folder that you've got. So as you can see here, I've got split video because I've just made a folder for it. So I will call it waterglass.mp4. So that's the one that I've got here. And then all I'm going to do is literally type out what I want it to be. So I'm going to have it as a file name. And then I always forget on this part, but this is basically saying I want to make it so it's a it has the file name precursor, uh, and then it'll be numerically ordered up to the fifth uh, digit uh, or fifth uh, five digits, uh, whatever it is. But anyway, again, I can't remember, but. And then you just put the file um, file extension, so it's going to be a, a PNG. So all we do is press enter or return, and it will go off. And as you can see, it's already thundering through for it. And it will come up here in a few seconds. This is actually, uh, I like slow motion videos, and this is basically getting the... Um, tone from you rubbing your finger around the top of a wine glass. Nothing exciting, but as you can see, it's, it's, it's gone through all this. And what we can then do is let's just let's go further in. Um, here we go. Yeah, it is five digits. It was close, so let's pick one and open it. So as you can see, there's nothing to see too much here, but I'll just. These are actually moving through. If I just open this here, so six, eight, nine. It doesn't look like I'm doing anything, but I'm just getting ready. So let's go a bit further down. Let's open that one up and close that. So you can see here, it's only just moving backwards. So I've used my Samsung Galaxy phone to do the slow motion, just to capture vibrations going through the glass. Nothing exciting. But it's me, it's nerdy, and obviously it's a gab thing. So I hope you've liked that. Uh, put a comment or something in there if you've enjoyed getting to this part. And hopefully let me know whether you've used it um, for any good use. I've got a multiple to, uh, multitude of uses for this. I did use this for when I showed that when I blew myself up. Hey, you know, it gives me the frame by frame analysis. I kind of do wish that I was having the slow motion, uh, slow motion video at this detail to see what happened. But anyway, so the usual stuff, like, share and subscribe, but hope you like the video. Oh, thanks. Bye.